In the 1920s, America was fascinated by radium, a glowing element hailed as a scientific marvel. Radithor, a bottled tonic labeled certified radioactive water, was created by William J. Day Bailey, a Harvard dropout with no medical credentials. Marketed as a cure-all, Radithor promised to restore vitality, boost energy, and even prolong life. Bailey's aggressive advertising tapped into the public's enthusiasm for new science, making Radithor wildly popular. Wealthy socialite and athlete Eben Byers became one of its most devoted users, consuming thousands of bottles. However, the tonic's radioactive nature proved deadly. Byers suffered severe bone decay, his jaw literally disintegrated, and he died in agonizing pain in 1932. His tragic case exposed the dangers of radioactive quackery and the lack of regulation. The ensuing scandal shocked the nation, prompting stricter government oversight and laying the groundwork for modern consumer protection in medicine, forever changing how health products are evaluated and marketed.